Carlos Solis is a high school senior at La Jolla ISD. A serious case, okay? You have somebody that's about to graduate. A good student, may I add, uh, made some wrong choices. Um, other kids made choices that could affect them as well. So Lise, who turned 19 on Thursday, now faces federal charges for receiving and possessing child pornography after Homeland Security investigators raided his home late last week. He's accused of creating a Facebook profile using the name Sandy Fernandez to get underage boys to send him inappropriate naked photos. A lot of kids, just because they think that they're young teenagers and that they're in school, that them asking for photographs of some of their colleagues, some of their friends, uh, it's not against the law, well, they're wrong. La Jolla ISD Police Chief Raul Gonzalez tells Action 4 News, children and teenagers need to be responsible about what they do on social media. And if you're 10 years or older, you could be facing state charges. And if you're 18 years old or older, you could be facing federal charges. So we strongly recommend that you don't ask for these type of pictures of your friends because you never know when your friend is going to turn you in. Conversing over Facebook may seem innocent, but sending naked photos is something Chief Gonzalez says can have long-term consequences. These pictures may come up, may come up 10 years from now when you're applying to be in an important position. And this could affect uh, your ability to have that job later on in life. It's why Chief Gonzalez says it's important that parents talk to their children. There's always somebody watching, and uh, sometimes the people that are watching are people who are the enforcers, and they want to enforce the law, and they want to protect kids, and it's a good thing. Um, but uh, we as parents, uh, we also need to monitor. You know, we pay for the phones. We pay for the Internet service, and it is our responsibility as well to help uh, our kids not make the wrong choices. In La Jolla, Ashley Custer, Action 4 News.